I'm Jo Wiley on Sky Arts. Today, we're bringing you an important report from Sky Skills Studios. Let's go straight to Studio One. Good afternoon. My name is Ali and I'm reporting from Sky. And my name is Joy. We're going to be talking about, about culture. You can learn lots of facts from different people from their religion and their cultures. When you move, you can change your culture. There are different foods in different countries and different dances, clothes and music. Now let's go to Francis. Talking about all, all the advantages and disadvantages of culture. Thank you, Ali and Joy. My name is Francis Carbo, reporting from Heathrow, Heathrow Airport. Our top story today is the advantages and disadvantages of culture diversity. Britain is now more racially diverse and integrated society than any time in its history. Now, over to Hassan. Thank you, Francis. Hello, I'm Hassan Hussein, and I'll be focusing on the advantages of cultural diversities. The advantages of cultural diversity include learning new languages, enjoying new food, and learning new faiths. This helps our society to be more exciting. Now over to Chantel. Thank you, Hassan. Hello, my name is Chantel Ricketts. I will be focusing on disadvantages of cultural diversity. The downside, try new foods, new languages and new religious. It, it, is, could, it could lead to racism, hatred and violence. Back to you, Francis. Thank you, Chantel. That's all from us now. Over to Ahmad. Hello, I'm Ahmad, reporting Life for Sky in Italy. I'm joined here by Rajib. So, Rajib, what do you do? Mamma mia, I'm, I run an Italian restaurant. I'm very rich. You don't look very Italian. Uh, yes, uh, I am Italian. Well, Rajib, we're joined here by your cousin, Anne Maria, who has a few words to say to you. Yes, I do. And you're not Italian. Yes, I am. You're not <laughs> Italian. You're, you're from Croydon and you're forsaking your culture. Rajib, do you think you should be true to your culture? Yeah, mamma mia, I run. Oh. <laughs> I can do what I like. Yes, you should. Otherwise, you're lying to people. Okay, fine. I'll come back to Croydon. That's all from me now. I'm handing back to the studio. Thank you, Iman. My name is Naila, and, um, and today I have been talking about the celebration of diversity, which is going to be taking place in Brockwell Park. I have two guests who... Um, who are joining me to discuss what are the plans happening. So, Mr Latif, what is going to be happening on the day? I've organised a farm fair full of, full of fun and, and, co and food from different cultures. And I've organised music from different cultures such as Jamaican, Jamaican, African, Asian, American and British bands. It's going to be full of fun and excitement. Um, what do you feel about this, Miss Orley? Well, it might sound fun, but there is going to be a lot of mess after the partying. The park will be destroyed and it will cost the taxpayer a lot of money. I do not agree with this celebration taking place. Surely Mr Latif has organised enough cleaners to tidy up. Well, of course I've organised enough cleaners to tidy it up. I, I, would, I don't want it to look like a pigsty, do I? 
Um, well, well, the cleaners want to have some money for doing their job, and if they don't get paid anything, then there's no point in them doing their job because they just really want some money. But they will get paid, and their taxpayer won't have to pay a single penny because I will use the fundings made from the fun fair to pay the cleaners, of course. Sorry, Miss Orley, but we've run out of time. And um, thank you for listening. Goodbye. Thank you for watching, and thank you to the Sky Skills studio team.